Hi everyone, so I am here today to give you another Can It Canapé. Mmm! Yes, can a lovely dish that we all know and love, canapé. First up, what is a canapé? It's a French word for a little something. A little kind of delicious bite, something that gets the lunch or the evening going, something to have with a drink. So it's a kind of cool thing, it's kind of party food, we like that. The dish that my team have given me is the Great British Roast. And this time, it's gonna be roast lamb. So, I do have some leftover roast lamb here. And I also have a little trick, a little ingredient that I buy every single week, that I use every single week, and it's really helpful for making delicious things like canapes. So, here I've got some leftover roast lamb. I've got some gravy here as well. I'm gonna take some of this out. This is about 500 grams of leftover roast lamb. You could use any meat. Um, if you had any veggies, potatoes, carrots, peas, you could put that in the mix as well. So we're gonna go with the gravy and mint. Mint sauce with roast lamb is an absolute classic. I'm just gonna run my knife through the lamb just to break it up like that and put this into a bowl. So we'll go in with some salt and pepper and then we're gonna go in with a little bit of the mint here and let's just take off the leaves. The stalks here you can use for making lovely mint tea. Mint and roast lamb for hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of years are best friends. So mint goes in. I'm gonna use a little gravy just to dress it up and make it just a little moist. Mix that around. So here is the little trick, phyllo pastry. It is a really delicate, fine pastry. And it comes in plastic because the minute you take it out, it will start to dry. So what we have to do as the cook is take a clean cloth and get it wet. You don't want the phyllo pastry to get dry because then it will be brittle and it will crack and it won't behave very well. So I have this in the fridge every single week. At the very least, buy a pack and put it in the freezer and it defrosts very quickly. So we're gonna take it like that and we're gonna cover it and that way it won't go dry. So I'm just gonna take that to one side. I'm gonna just take this phyllo pastry like that. I'm gonna slice it in half on a clean surface and then I'm gonna take a little bit of our lamb here and just stuff it. So just bring in the sides and just roll it up like that. Once you've rolled it up, take some of that oil and just brush your little can it canapé roast lamb cigar and then we'll lay it onto a roasting tray like this. And we'll repeat this until this tray is wrapped out and then you're gonna basically bake this in the oven. And in that time it takes to cook that, we're gonna knock up a beautiful little salsa verde and reheat a little bit of gravy and the two things together should be incredible. So there you go. This is pure potential. Uh, you could put that in the fridge now if you wish. And when your guests come around, just bang them in the oven. They're gonna go in at 180 degrees Celsius, which is 350 Fahrenheit, for around about 20 minutes until golden, crisp, and delicious. In it goes. If you're enjoying this, then please click the like button and give us some love. And don't forget to subscribe. Oh, and remember to turn on that notification bell so you know what's happening. Now, back to the recipe. With this excess pastry, it's still good to go, right? So what I would normally do is just keep that wet cloth that is clean and just roll it up like this. And I just pop it back in the fridge for a day or two. So we have these crispy, gorgeous things celebrating beautiful roast lamb. And what I wanna do is have something to dip it in. So if you're doing a nice little canapé, cocktail party, little bit of a nibble, it's quite nice to be able to pick it up and dip it in something and get that kind of explosion of flavour. So what we're gonna do is a lovely kind of riff on a salsa verde, slightly simpler. So we're gonna take mint, it could be any green herbs, but traditionally it'll be parsley or mint, uh, depending on what's in season. So I'll take those off of the stalk like that. Then we're gonna use some capers. So a little bit salty, these are in brine. Just give them a little squeeze. I've got some anchovy here. So just a couple of anchovy fillets. I will use a little bit of lemon zest. And as we all know, garlic and lamb are very good friends. So we don't need loads, half a clove of garlic. You can chop the garlic or you can actually just use that little grater. Can you see? Going in there like that. 
So now we can start chopping and we'll chop the garlic, the capers, the anchovy first and get it fairly fine and then start chopping the mint. So when it's nice and finely chopped, let's get it into a little bowl. Fragrant mint and capers, just delicious. I'll steal some of that oil from the anchovy and then I'll just use some olive oil just to loosen the herbs. Then we'll kind of break that with a little vinegar, just about a thimble, a couple of teaspoons. And what I want to do is add some mustard, just to give it a little bit of a creaminess and a little more oil, just to loosen it. So you can see it's got a nice little drizzle to it. So I'm going to put the salsa verde here, like that. I'm going to reheat some gravy because I can't help myself. Just going to rinse it out with a little water. So I'll bring that gravy back to the boil. Kind of just to remind you, this is roast lamb with gravy being canapéed into these beautiful little crispy cigars. So we're going to take one of those, dip it in the gravy maybe, hit it up with a little salsa verde in the mouth, hopefully explosion, deliciousness and happiness. Right, let's let those cook and then I'll show you how to serve. So, can it canapé? <laughs> yes, it can. With the help of salsa verde, some lovely gravy. So let's load these up, just stack them erratically. The smell is amazing. So there you go, lovely people. Roast lamb phyllo cigars, golden crispy, with a lovely salsa verde dip. Actually, I'm salivating because the smell, <laughs> smell is so good. Gordon Bennett. So there you go. So salsa verde, hot gravy. Come on. Uh, if you want to just sort of get the colour vibes going, you could put a couple bits of mint over. It's always nice. There you go. Can it canapé? Yes, it can. <laughs> right, let's take one of our little cigars. Let's have a little dip up in the gravy. Oh, look at that. We've got the gravy. Let's hit this up with some salsa verde. Look at the colour. Oh my goodness. Mmm. It's so good. Mate, if you get some friends around. Oh my god. It's so good. Delicious. Get yourself some filo pastry, make a salsa verde, and celebrate your leftover roast dinners. Enjoy.